Um, hi, brothers and sisters in Christ. Um, considering the rate at which um, people are falling away from the Christian faith, I had to make this video. and uh, I want to talk about a few things. First of all, I want to talk about um, how much worse on, is it going to be for former Christians on Judgment Day. By former Christians, I mean Christians who were born into a Christian family, but later rejected the faith. How much worse is it going to be for them on Judgment Day compared to someone who was born into a Muslim family? If you're born into a Christian family, you're born into a Christian family. All you got to do is accept the faith, accept Jesus, um, have Him cleanse Him with your blood, repent of your sins, and you're pretty much, you're in heaven, right? Just, just follow Christianity, but... You don't, if you're born into a Christian family, you don't have to go through persecution and converting. But, so if you're, if God has blessed you and you're born into a Christian family, you departed from the faith, you're making the biggest mistake of your life. You had the, probably the greatest, one of the greatest blessings known to man and you threw it away. How much, how much war, how much harder is it for a Muslim to come to the Christian faith? Than somebody who's already a Christian. The Mus in some Muslim countries, you can get killed for leaving the faith. But if you're already born into a Christian family, you, you don't have to go through persecution and converting. You're already in. You were blessed and don't throw it away. The great apostasy is happening right now. Christians are departing from the faith like never before. They're not realizing the blessings they have. They're rejecting Christ. They're rejecting Christianity. And they're how much i can't even think how much worse you're gonna stand in front of jesus on judgment day what are you gonna say jesus is gonna be like i blessed you in a christian family why'd you depart from the faith what are you gonna say oh i didn't know my science professor told me evolution is real and god doesn't exist so i believe them what is the former christian gonna how's he gonna justify himself how he or she you can't you can't justify yourself there's nothing you can do God blessed you and you and you rejected his blessing, you threw it away. I can't even begin to imagine. I mean all the what if what if the Muslims that were born in a Muslim family, what if they could have been saved if they were born in a Christian family? If you're born in a Christian family, don't take it for granted. You don't have to be killed for converting to Christianity. You're already in. Wow, it. I mean, these people, and then I feel bad, and then for some reason, talking to former Christians, I feel bad for them, but then I realize they sealed their own faith. I try, if you just try to talk to them, convert them, and then you realize, why am I feeling bad for this person? He was blessed, and he threw it away. It's not my fault that he threw it away. It's not God's fault he threw it away. It's his fault, his or her fault. I mean, what if a Muslim that was born in his place could have been saved? Wow, the people are throwing their blessings away. It's, it's crazy. It blows my mind. And it's ironic. The number of Christians I personally know, like personally, concerning family, friends, not like um, the YouTube community. I mean, I know so many great Christians on the YouTube community, and I'm truly blessed to be part of this experience but uh, speaking personally I can count the number of Christians I know on my right hand I mean number of Christians I know that were born t in the Christian family and but they're not Christian I can count how many actual Christians I know that were born into a Christian family and they're still like Christian I can count them on my right hand that's scary so if you're not a Christian anymore and you were truly blessed to be a blessed to be born into a Christian family, there's nothing you can say on Judgment Day that will justify you. You threw away the great greatest blessing in your life. How much worse is it gonna be for you than all the other people that weren't born into a Christian family? These are questions you seriously need to start thinking about if you're departing away from the Christian faith. Wow. And also in the description box of this video, I have a message. Please do anything you can to spread that message to warn the people. If it if it wins one soul to the kingdom of heaven, glory to God. If if the time you spent on 
copy pasting that message was a waste of your time so be it what did you lose nothing you lose you lost a couple of seconds that's what i wanted to talk about um all glory to god because all glory belongs to him thanks for listening